Good morning everyone, it's Nutty New here in Anchorage, Alaska. We're doing an ammo update. Today is February 15th. I hope you guys had a wonderful Valentine's, it's the year 2021. So it's currently 9.51 a.m. East Side Anchorage, Bass Pro, they open at 10 a.m. This is my first time ever witnessing a line outside Bass Pro here. I'm gonna show you this line. It has maybe about 30, I wanna say 20, eh, maybe 30 people. 30 people out here 10 minutes till opening and it's monday so mondays and wednesday are technically their ship dates or their truck days so fingers crossed even if i don't get any ammo as long as there's ammo this morning that's a good sign because i don't really need it so if these guys really need ammo that much they're more than happy to buy all the ammo i'm just want to show you guys if there's any ammo so we might get a big disappointment or at least these guys might get a big disappointment or these guys and girls, they might be able to find what they need today. Take a look. So 10 minutes till opening, we have a nice line already here. You can see that's the front doors. And then there's also more people on the left side. They just made it curved out a little bit. So we're gonna give it maybe, uh, we're just gonna wait till, it's, we'll, we'll wait till they open the door. Once they open the doors, we'll go and make our way in. Because honestly, uh, with the limit, the, the limit that they set, I think the two bucks limit or something like that, I'm not too worried. And uh, you can see more people coming up right now. This guy's going there to get lined up. And you can see here, the parking lot's fully, it's not packed, but you know, it's more people than the average. And uh, people know the schedules nowadays. So it's really, it's really crazy. I remember when uh, everything first started, People didn't really think about the actual scheduled day when each store get their ammo. But now everyone knows when Cabela's get their ammo, when Bass Pro gets their ammo. So Monday's and Wednesday. And uh, we're going to go find out if there's any ammunition today. Like I said, man, we might find something or it might just be a big disappointment. Just so you guys know, the line is way over here too. And there it goes. The door is open. Check out this line here. Look at that. At least about 20, 30, 40 people already. Come on, you guys gotta move faster. Everyone is all here for ammunition. Look at that. That is crazy. Wow. Look at this family here. They brought their whole kids, and even that little boy has a right. No, that boy. That boy's underage. Look at that line, man. Holy smoke. You know what's crazy? We can actually just wait here for the next five minutes. And if people start coming back out, we all know there's no ammo. So literally, we can just wait here for the next 10 minutes. And if people start coming out, that's a clear sign that there's no ammunition. That'd be really, really funny to see here. But let's go ahead and make our ways inside because I know you guys are all anxious to see what's going on. So let's go check out the ammo inventory. Look at that, there's the line. <laughs> that's the ammo line, guys. <laughs> Holy smoke. So that's the ammo line. We're not gonna get a line because we're not even actually gonna buy ammo. So if they start, if they start whining about me cutting the line, <clears throat> I'm just gonna tell them that I'm not here for the ammo. So there is ammo, guys. All these folks, they all have green tips. Let's see. <laughs> yeah, some guys have green tips, 150, 150 round packs of green tips in their uh, bags. But there's like a long line that's getting you into the line. So they're letting people go in once at a time. That's crazy. That's crazy, man. There's the line for the ammo. You got to come in from the other way, so we're just gonna check it out. We're gonna get we're not gonna get a close up look. Look at that full wall of ammo. And it uh, looks like it's white tip. It looks like it's five. 
green tip. Looks like green tip and nine mil, but all that's gonna be gone soon. We're not gonna give you guys a close up look because there's like a super long line, guys. So we know there's ammo on Monday, guys. So it's it's true, man. There's ammunition on Mondays. I saw some customer with uh, the 150 round green tip and some nine mil blazer. So here's the front door. And you can see the lines all the way back to the front door here. Crazy, man. Crazy, crazy. Ammo is alive here on Mondays in Anchorage, Alaska. But again, it's super, super packed. We're not even gonna get a close up look. And uh, there's ammo for sure. There's nine mil. Well guys, the time is 10, 11, just 10 minutes after opening. And the line is still long inside. Everybody's lined up there waiting to get their ammo. So for sure there was nine mil, for sure there was green tip, 150 round cases. I saw with my own eyes, it was all in the customers, the little bucket they were holding. And uh, there's a good amount of ammunition, but I have a good feeling that it's gonna be gone the next hour. We decided not to wait because like I said, I didn't wanna wait with all the people. I don't really need it anyway. So I just wanted to see if there's any ammo and for sure, there's ammo on Mondays on Bass Pro. Maybe we'll come back here in the next few hours and see if there's any more ammo. All right, guys, so I decided to go run the rest of my errands for the morning, and it's currently 10.30 a.m., so 10.30 a.m., 30 minutes after opening. We are gonna go back to Bass Pro, get in line, if there's a line. We're gonna go ahead and get in line and actually get to the ammo section. If we get there and there's ammo, I'll go ahead and pick up a few boxes just for the video purpose and stuff like that. So let's go back to Bass Pro, get in line, ah, ah, get with the vultures and grab us some ammunition. Okay, so we left for about 20 minutes just to let the crowd calm down, if the crowd has calmed down yet. So let's go back and uh, actually get in line here. Nice Rubicon. Let's go back and get in line and see if the ammo Let's see if the ammo supply is still good. It's only 10.33 a.m. and this parking lot is freaking loaded right now, man. Woohoo! If you guys are local from Anchorage, Alaska, make sure you guys follow our Facebook page, Alaska Ammo Fine, where we post up live intel from all over the... Everybody, locals doing locals. This gentleman here has some ammo. Any ammo left? Oh yeah, thank you. <laughs> I want to go to all the folks that's uh, in line. I, I just want to ask them one question. I want to ask them, hey, do you really need to buy ammo today? Do you really need to buy ammo today? All right, guys, so the line is shorter now. <coughs> the line is only to right there. <coughs> it was way back at the door earlier. So that guy, that guy got some hurts. Looks like some hurt nine mil. Everybody got nine mil. So it looks like right now I can see some nine mil. <coughs> Just from over here, I can see some nine mil. Looks like there's some five, five, six five boxes to the limit that lady has five boxes um, looks like it's just some regular herders nine mil target range i'm gonna guess that maybe they're like 15 16 bucks a box so well maybe we'll grab like a couple boxes we'll see what happens i got a few buddies that need some ammo too so i might consider picking some up for those guys got some defense nine little uh target nine ten defense all right guys so 10 45 a.m when i got inside i only had to wait like five minutes there's like maybe 10 people in front of me i got there and i found some ammunition so there was still plenty of ammunition there was the nine mil <coughs> the herders there's plenty of this stuff i believe the limit was five bucks we only went and grabbed two bucks and we also got 
four boxes uh, four boxes of these guys four boxes of the Winchester green tip m855 i believe the limit was like five bucks on this too but again we don't need to get all of our limit so i know for sure when i was here this morning like i said when they opened i saw a bunch of people um with the 150 round packs of these guys so they did have the 150 round packs of the green tip and again those are the fastest one to go out because it's actually cheaper to buy in bulk so whenever you're buying ammo try to buy bulk ammo try to buy the bulk ammo because you save way more money so that's obviously why people were buying all those um plenty of nine mil um like i said they they had a line so it was one person in the aisle one person at a time so i didn't have too much time to film but they had nine mil for the first time i finally saw some um God, I forgot their name. The cheap ammo, the steel ammo, the tool ammo. For the first time, I actually found tool ammo. They had tool ammo 223 for $6.99, which is a really high price. Back in the old days, it was only like $4.99. But yeah, they had Tula for 223. And I was like, man, should I buy Tula 223? I, sh I should have bought Tula 223 because I could have got more for my money just for shooting just for plinking around i should have bought some tool at 223 but it's all good uh, we got some n855 and again we don't really really need these ammunition so we'll just put them in the storage for now or we might just give them away and you know give them away to somebody who that who literally needs it but again ammo shortage in alaska like I say it's a good day it's a good monday we found ammo we actually got our hands on some ammo today so hopefully you guys are finding ammo in your in your place Remember, Bass Pro, they get their ammos on Mondays and Wednesday. And I have a feeling that all the ammos in here, all the green tip, I have a feeling that they're going to last till either afternoon. And also, we got to keep in mind that it's Monday. It's Monday and also it's President's Day, so it's a holiday. So a lot of people aren't working today. They have the day off. So that might be the reason why there was a lot of people today because people don't have to work. So that all that stuff make all this little all this little traffic here so hopefully you guys are doing well hopefully you guys are finding ammo in your state let me know in the comment section what you guys found and i'll catch you guys next time peace out